This is the third in our series of videos about the change to first inventor to file. We will talk about prior art or novelty, but this time we're going to look at one more subsection of the law. This one is 102, subsection A, paragraph 2. It further defines prior art. As you probably remember, prior art is used to determine if an invention is eligible for a patent. So here's the language of the law. A person shall be entitled to a patent unless the claimed invention was described in a patent issued under Section 151 or in an application for patent published or deemed published under Section 122B in which the patent or application, as the case may be, names another inventor and was effectively filed before the effective filing date of the claimed invention. We need to look at a couple of things to understand this. See where it says Sections 151 and 122B? These are other sections of patent law. Section 151 refers to published U.S. patents. Okay, easy enough. Section 122B refers to published U.S. patent applications. But there's another application type to look at as well. It also includes applications published under the Patent Cooperation Treaty, or PCT. The PCT is a way for inventors all over the world to file for patent protection in multiple countries. If an application has been under the PCT and designates the United States as a country where patent protection will be sought, then that application can be used as prior art. Now, the other thing we need to understand is the term another inventor. Another inventor is an inventor that is listed on one published application or patent, but not on the application in question. So what does all this mean? Well, an inventor can get a patent unless the claimed invention was published in a U.S. patent, a U.S. application, or a PCT application. Of course, this only applies if the publication names another inventor and has an effective filing date earlier than the effective filing date of the claimed invention. Now, there are certain exceptions to 35 U.S.C. 102A, Paragraph 2. To learn about them, please view the next video.